so friend welcome welcome to the channel again uh, you can see that we have html file and ats file here so in the html file you can see there is a p tag with a event click and on click a download method is called with a parameter this so parameter is nothing but a php api you can see the downloader.php extension this and after this we pass a query string file name is equal to this dot pdf file so by this simple html tag with these attributes you can simply guess that this is this uh, url is going to download that particular pdf file so this is nothing but a php api where we pass the a query string as a file name and uh, when we call this uh, it will perform downloading so if we just simply copy this and uh, and when we try to run here uh, you can see it's performed the downloading so if we hit this url simply on the browser it performs the downloading of that particular file so this is the way to download in the browser but uh, uh, how, but we will check how we can do this in code through ionic capacitor angular app so basically we will perform downloading by using this api and after downloading we will save that downloaded file inside our phone so we will check later first we will check the php api so you can see this is the file name and this is the php api so this php api will perform this downloading this uh, downloading of that file so if we check the php code uh, you can see it simply get the query string file name and uh, perform the downloading by simple these codes so this is the php code uh, to perform the downloading and let's check the let's check now the ionic code how we can call this api to downloading the pdf file so this is the html and now let's check the download function so we are on the ts file so before checking download let's check what we have imported to perform which codes so first we imported http client to call the api and second is file system from capacitor slash file system it's nothing but it will be used to save that downloaded file inside your phone so we have two plugin here uh, these are the ionic plugins uh, i will put the download link in the description of this video i will put the plugin link in the description of the video so now let's check the code you can see this is the download function and the download the parameter is url which we already saw you in the html part we passed up uh, url uh, url uh, inside the download function this is the parameter basically so after getting the url uh, we simply perform permission do you want to download pdf in phone if user click ok then these code are will be executed so let's say uh, user click ok now we retrieve the file name by simply splitting the url at is equal to and after splitting at is equal to we have two array and the second one is the file name so you can see in the url here is equal is equal to if you split here uh, we have two parts first one is this and second one is this so this is the file name so we will i uh, use the second element to binding the file name so we have file name now after this uh, we simply call the http client get method and inside get we have two parameters first is the url of the api and second we have to mention the response type what will the what will be the response type of the particular php code so as we know the php api returns the file in the response so the response type is blob type blob is nothing but refer to a file 
so uh, now this HTTP client get method is uh, it does the observables uh, observables and in the observables uh, we have a parameter response of type blob so this is the blob type data we retrieve from the api by using the get api so this is the result in the blob format and after getting blob we have to convert this in, in base 64 so converting this blob file in base 64 we have to use simple these codes so first we have to create the object of file reader and file reader have a method read as data url to reading the base 64 of that particular blob file so inside read as data url we pass the parameter res and res nothing but the blob type data so and after this after calling this function we bind the event on load end of the file reader and on load event we call a function so when the load event executes we have the result of the base 64 so reader file reader have a property result result is nothing but the resultant base 64 of that particular blob file and after getting result we just simply call the to string method to retrieve the data in a string format this is put nothing but a, a string uh, a string type data so and after this getting this result we assign in a variable in a property base 64 and now this base 64 is the final result uh, after the downloading the calling the php api so we have done with the calling of php api because we have the, all these things we have the base, base 64 of the downloaded file so the base 64 is here now we call a we call a save pdf method inside save pdf we simply pass the base 64 uh, string base 64 data so if you check the base 64 uh, we simply use here file system uh, file system is this this file system this is the capacitor plugin i will put the link of this plugin inside the description of the video and file system have a method write file write file is nothing but it will be used to save that file uh, inside your phone memory so write file have some parameter path we pass the path we pass the data we pass the directory path is nothing but the name of the file which we already retrieved by splitting the url and data is nothing but the base 64 of the downloaded file this is the base 64 we get from the parameter and directory where we have to save that particular file so in this case we use the documents directory directory dot documents so your this file will be saved inside the documents of your phone so after and after this it returns the promise after successful i sim simply return the alert the file saved at at what file what what path it will return the uri if there will be any error it will return the simply error so this is the code basically and let's check the demo of this whole code on our phone so let's check the demo first. <laughs> 